This show is sponsored by GTWay.com. Please stop by for cheap games and awesome savings. Links in the description. Well, what's up, guys? I've got DG, and yeah, today we're gonna actually start some decks. Now, um, I've probably had like maybe an hour of actual gameplay, but I'm starting a brand new game for you guys. And just off the break, we're gonna completely skip through the opening because no matter what system I play this on, I have problems with the opening. I have tried to record this video several times, and I've always run into issues, but we're gonna get this motherfucker out today. So, let's get started. <laughs> Get started from the very beginning, huh? What the fuck? Okay, unit, use the stairs. You have a natural dispensation for this. Now quickly, out of the window. Go to Victor's home. It's a hacktivist bar. You should be safe. Talk to Decker there. Tell him Raycat sent you. Now run. As you can tell, I've played this opening maybe like 12 or 13 times just trying to get this to work. Ooh, goodies. Huh. Fight Club. Alright, we're going to tear this dude up. I know he's the first bandy, but he's got to get it. Would you believe I missed that jump like three or four times? Time to jump my man out. Night, night. Huh. All right, so we're gonna use these cutscenes to have quick conversations. And I'm like, I really like this game. I think you guys should like this game too. This was actually on the Steam sale where I picked it up, so you guys should totally grab it. It's normally I think like 10, 15 bucks. And you really can't go wrong. It plays really well. And welcome to Dex, a cyberpunk dystopian of just beat him up with augmented reality where I kind of feel like augmented reality Jesus. You understand what I mean? Time to get into the meat and potatoes of the game, I guess. Tutorials aren't necessarily over, but still. Alright, I seem to have leveled up. So, let's jump off the elevator and, like, decide what we want to do. Hmm. Alright. So, the first thing I should probably take should be lockpick. Because there's a couple of doors that we can pick coming up in a little bit. But we're not going to do that. We are totally going to put a point in melee. And the reason for that is we want to beat face. As you saw when we fought the first guard, it was like really bad. And I'm like, it took us a long time to beat him because we only have a two punch combo. So we're, we're, we're going to up our, our fight game real quick. I specifically hate pipes in this game because you can clearly tell we bought the bus our ass, but we're going to try to make this jump. Let's go. One. Oh shit. And we're down. Well, 
Looky at you. What do we have here? Some little bird falling down from her nest. Everything's prowling down below, girl. Should have stayed up top, up there with them respectable. Doing? None of your business what we be doing. You ain't asking questions here. This is Cedar's territory, my territory, and you be trespassing. Now, what you really here for, huh? You one of them clean up the street type of police? One of them dig the dirt new people sniffing around looking up for your big break? I don't think we can be taking no chances, brother. Now, let's see what's in your pockets, girl. You ain't got no but invite. Maybe you got something for my hospitality. Or maybe you can stick around. You got a boyfriend? Someone who'll pay a pretty price to see your pretty face again? Oh, I haven't even done preparing your death warrant, and here you are all ready for the sign. Boy, can you please show this girl some notoriety? I'm not gonna hold you. I really like her, like, way of talking. <laughs> because, yo, know, like, for real, like, she used so many damn metaphors, you would have thought she was a Philly rapper. But notice how we doing a little more damage with our third hit now. We gotta do a lot of jump kicks, because that knocks him down, because you, you definitely wanna fight two or three people at a time. Even though right here, he's, like, deciding not to attack me, because that's stupid. But fuck it, we're gonna, like, just beat these dudes and, you know, face in, like, get him. Ha <laughs> ha knocks you over, punk ass. But that's how you fight in this game. Time to fight the mini balls, baddie. And I, I, I did, you'll see me fight a couple of these chain freaks a couple of times throughout this fight. And it's just like, no, I really hate these guys because they do certain things that make it really hard to get them. Luckily, Lorraine does not do them. Remember I told you about the lockpick? Could have been us, but I, I doubt that. I'm so sorry for that, folks. Uh, it looks like we had a problem with the video corrupt, and I'm not sure when and where that actually happened. It was working fine earlier, but it looks like we cut ahead about three or five minutes. To give you some background on what's going on, we need a key to get upstairs. And the nice gentleman with the garble text has the key, but he won't give it to us until, well, we come use C4 to blow up the bridge to this gang's hideout. So we're gonna, well, blow this shit to hell. Told you a lockpick come in handy. <laughs> Motherfucker.
Looks like we're done here. Bridge go boom. about me got food to last me years and my friends up all right looks like we're gonna go upstairs and thank god we're actually just gonna end this travesty at the very top of this ladder because my god i cannot deal with this as I said, we've had some problems with the video, but we will totally not have any problems going forward because we will take our time and figure out exactly what's going on with setup. But thanks for watching. This is part one of our hopefully full playthrough of decks. You guys get back at us, and as always, this is Epic SVG signing out. Thanks for watching. Y'all keep it gangster. Peace.